so I'm not sure now. I think I might be up to part six on this video. And I think I'll make it to the end of this beach and be able to go and have a beer in Trapreya Road. But I'll do a beat video down here. So you'll have two on the truck, so probably going to be bored shitless, but I'm just trying to get uh, a little bag log of videos, so when I do have a quiet time, I've, uh, I can fill with these videos, so, but still lovely videos, I mean. Getting a little quieter down this way. Still people about. I can see a definite difference now to what it was like two months ago. Around the start of October when I was staying over this way. Certainly picked up a bit touristy, a few more people about and they reckon that the tourist season will start proper around November. So obviously all the bar owners, the businesses that rely on the tourists are hoping that's going to pick up. A very nice, enjoyable walk back down to Trapea Road. Well, I'm going to sit down and have another beer before heading back to my condo and having another beer. Now I might even have something to eat. He's got the right idea. Team chilling. Sun's going down, so it's not burning you. Got himself a beer, sat on his phone, headphones on. What a life. I'm starting to run out of things to talk about, even though I do talk bollocks most of the time. But you don't really have to say too much when you're walking on a place like this. It's just beautiful. I just love I love the trees on the beach where you can sit under the shade of the tree. Go and have a dip if you want to risk the, the sea. But yeah, just really nice. Certainly one of the nicer places to be around the Patea area. Obviously you got the uh, main part of Patea where it's all bars and go-go and girls everywhere trying to get your money. Down here, it's a bit different. You've got the beach sellers. Trying to sell your beer and ornaments and whatever, so they're trying to get your money as well. But total different vibe, obviously. And then you got straight ahead of us, you got John T M, which is almost like a quiet version of the day. You've got so many go go's, so many, so many deep uh, girly bars but it's just on a smaller scale so you can find a little bit of peace and quiet down there Hello! <laughs> Hello! YouTube! YouTube! Cheap Dave! New look, Cheap Dave! 
We all taking selfies, checking themselves out. But yeah, just lovely down there. Probably said that about 20 times. But it is. We got the moon. Just about to see it there. Let's have another look at the sunset. Going down over Kowland. Looking so, so beautiful. So yeah, I reckon by the time I walk down to prepare road, the sun will be going down over the horizon. And then we'll be beer o'clock. So this is so nice. Big point and down down here. I think when I get down to where the main road comes down, prepare road into John TM. After that, it'll be getting a little bit busier on the beach. But this time of night, people are just chilling, having a beer, just generally relaxing. And it's so good. Now this man here, <laughs> this man here, he has caught, he has caught, yes, yeah, what he can, this many shells look. For dinner? Yeah. Food? Good, thank you. Cup and cab. So he has got a lot of shells. You've got that building just through the trees there. I think that will be the end of Prepare Road and I'll be able to get up off the beach and put my feet up again. I think by the end of it I'll have done somewhere between four and five miles. So for a miserable old man like me it's a long way. So it's good. We haven't got too far to go now. I reckon about another quarter of a mile and I'll be I'll be off the beach. Nice of walking on this hard wet sand, you're not sinking in as much. Still a little bit harder work than walking on the kerb. I will get, I will go up off the beach before I get to the prayer because there's a little area where they do the skateboarding and the skating and new, uh, dancing to the music, keeping fit. So I will go up off the beach there. I thought you'd got a lovely blue shirt on. What a lovely blue shirt, eh? <laughs> Sometimes I just can't help myself. You got someone reading help on the beach. Why well, you need help down here? I don't know. But I'm gonna make that name my way 
up off the beach here. So this will be my last sunset picture of my of my walk. So we got another view of Kolan over there. Sun going down over the sea there. Beautiful view. Family, all the kids playing in the water. Beautiful place to be. So we'll go up off the beach. Make our way up here. Anyone likes beaches? This will be the video for you. So we're going up off the beach. Now this evening they will have a lot of people around this area selling street food. Up to that building there, so you can see where I got to. Let's walk along the beach front because it's nice there. So you can see through the palm trees, beautiful sunset, looks fantastic. Not really an awful lot to say about it. It just looks really nice. Families here just having picnics, ready to go fishing, stuff like that. But really nice. A squirrel going up the tree. Yeah, it's gone. There's one on the back of that tree there. Don't know whether you can make him out or not. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, so you get a lot of street sellers knocking out the food down here. This area in the evening, maybe a little bit later when it cools off a bit more. We have two or three, probably two aerobic classes going on down here. So people liking to keep fit. That building up ahead is the local police station. Lots of people here taking pictures of the sunset now. People here, got all their gear ready for the aerobic session later. The knees are sweeping the floor, getting you ready for another aerobic session here. So, this is almost the end of my walk now. You look where I am. Beautiful sunset over Kolan or next to Kolan, but really looking nice. So I am going to head up through Paya Road and go and grab a beer. That's the plan. These are the ladies that are going to be exercising, keeping fit, and the men. So we're going to be heading up for Prayer Road now. We're going to go to one of the bars up there. There's an electric motor there. 
sea lo que da. I'm not sure what brand it is. You tell me. Right, so I've made it. And then walking now I've got to do is up to the bar up the road. Just up here. And well, I'll just put my flip flops on. Might as well keep this video going till I get to the bar. And then uh, I have to call it a day. So you've got the street sellers started now, just here. You've got the chicken on sticks and toy food, you've got the fruit, the papayas, the apples, the pineapple. Seven Eleven there. Oh, someone was asking about the exchange rate. So this one's for him, uh, US dollar 36.2, Euro 38.3, pound is 44, back to the pound, Australian 22.60, and the one that I was asked was the SEC, which is Sweden, and the SEC, especially for my friend there, is 2.4 sec so that's why you get into the bow uh, to the bat over here so I'll uh, let him know that I'm gonna go for a beer now just have a quiet one I do like <coughs> excuse me I do like the Panacea bar here, so I'm going to stop here, have a quiet beer, that'll be the end of this vlog, so if you can like, subscribe, press the bell, uh, I'll be back with some more junk tomorrow, thank you very much.